Ever wondered how SpaceX rockets, after blasting into space at thousands of kilometers per hour, somehow managed to turn around and land perfectly upright? T Today on Knowledge Hub, we're exploring one of the most revolutionary feats in aerospace engineering, how SpaceX rockets land themselves. When a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket lifts off, it's actually made of two stages. The upper stage carries the payload, like satellites or supplies for the ISS into orbit, while the first stage, the booster, is the one that returns to Earth. Traditionally, rockets were single-use. They'd burn up or crash into the ocean after launch. SpaceX changed that by making rockets reusable, drastically reducing the cost of spaceflight. But landing a 50-meter-tall metal cylinder that's moving at hypersonic speed? That's the tricky part. Here's how it works. After stage separation, the first stage flips around using cold gas thrusters, tiny nitrogen-powered jets that reorient the rocket so its engines face forward. Then, it performs a boost back burn, firing some of its nine Merlin engines to cancel its horizontal velocity and begin the journey back toward the landing site. Once it's on the right trajectory, it coasts through the upper atmosphere, still moving at several times the speed of sound. Next comes the re-entry burn. This short engine firing slows the rocket down enough to survive the intense heat and stress of re-entering the thicker parts of Earth's atmosphere. The booster's titanium grid fins then deploy. These are like small wings that steer the rocket by controlling airflow, allowing it to adjust its path in real time. Think of them as the rocket's steering wheel during descent. As it approaches the landing site, either the of course I still love you, or just read the instructions drone ship, the rocket performs its final move, the landing burn. Only the center Merlin engine ignites now, providing precise thrust control to slow the descent. Using radar and GPS data, the onboard computer continuously adjusts the thrust vector and the position of the rocket's engine nozzle to keep it perfectly balanced. And in the final seconds, the rocket's landing legs deploy, locking into place just before touchdown. The entire process is autonomous. No human pilots it. It's all done by advanced algorithms, sensors, and control systems that process data hundreds of times per second. If anything goes wrong, like bad weather or an off-angle approach, the rocket is programmed to abort and safely ditch itself into the ocean, rather than risk damage to the landing pad. This incredible precision is what makes SpaceX unique. Each successful landing not only saves millions in hardware, but also brings us closer to true rocket reusability, turning spaceflight from a disposable operation into a sustainable system. And the data from every single landing feeds back into improving the next one, paving the way for future missions like Starship and Mars colonization. If you've ever been amazed watching a rocket land on a floating platform after roaring into space, that's not movie magic. It's the power of physics, software, and sheer innovation working in perfect sync. If you enjoyed learning how SpaceX rockets land themselves, don't forget to subscribe to Knowledge Hub for more deep dives into the technology shaping our future. And as always, stay curious.